Hey, Dr. Lady, uh, this is a video response to your Fang Face uh, review. And um, I did leave a comment about mine being in storage in not proper conditions, and I just wanted to show you the fate of my Fang Face. And it's very depressing, and I just wanted to show you exactly what happened to the poor guy. Um, as you can see, it's ruined, and it's beyond any help. Uh, finding a, a replacement of a vintage one has been... Well, I haven't been able to do it. I, I can find the, uh, the modern version, which I don't really like as much. Or, uh, to be perfectly honest, I don't like it that much at all. And I really rather would have this classic version. Um, if you have any advice on where to find one, that'd be great. Uh, I'm going to salvage the hood because uh, it's it's good. The hood is in good shape and I like the the fabric that it's made from, this plush fabric. Um, my dad found this for me at a yard sale for about, I don't know, 75 cents and it was in, uh, I'd say about 93 or 94 and this poor guy was in storage um, after I moved out of my folks house and I think they just kind of threw it in a box and it was flattened out inside of a box with other boxes stacked on top of it inside of a U-Haul storage room for 13 years and to be honest I'm surprised it's actually in this good of shape that it is uh, considering I've had other masks in um, the Arizona heat that just became completely tacky and goopy and just it dissolved. Uh, I don't fancy myself a mask collector, but this is one that's very special to me for sentimental reasons, and I I do want to get a replacement for it. Um, I don't really want to pay that much for it, but I really doubt I'm going to find one for 75 cents. It's more likely I'm going to find one for like 75 dollars, but you know maybe one of these days I can find a vintage one from a collector or I can uh, get somebody like a mask maker expert to replicate it, the original version just for my own specific wants not for uh, devaluing collectors uh, purposes or anything like that I, I don't want to hurt anybody's um, collector value on their on their masks uh, but yeah if I were to buy a mask this would be the one I would get I don't I'm not I'm not really a mask collector per se I do like uh, a few here and there but this one in particular is just one that I've been very attached to for a long time anyway rest in peace good old fang face and take care